Hey guys, this is Jen DeLeon, and today at Dash Radio, we have a very special guest, Anderson Pack. How are you doing today? Yes, Lord. Nice. You feel me? <laughs> I think that's good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That means good. Pretty good. Um, okay, so Oxnard just came out. I'm going to do something different with our interview. So instead of asking you about the music and the features, I'm taking your track list, picking some of my favorite lyrics, and asking you a question based off that. All right. So first one. Um, who are you? That's track four. I had the vision back in 12th grade lunchtime that I'd be killing shit with Dr. Dre. What else did you envision when you were in the 12th grade that either already came to life or you know will come to life in the future? Um, I was envisioning myself like rocking shows, like big mm -hmm. shows. Um, uh, yeah, just being in the studio, making music, traveling the world, uh, driving fast cars. Yeah. Mm -hmm. nice. yeah. Um, did you have, well, so did you have a, like a vision board or a vision notebook or, I mean, people usually have that kind of stuff. So what was your, how you kept track of your vision? Not, not back then. Like all I did was just lock myself in a room and, and make beats like back mm -hmm. then. Like anybody that know me when I was in high school, yeah. I had like my own room and I had like a mixing board and PC. Yeah. I was DJing, making mixtapes for the school. I was yeah. DJing like my school dances and stuff. Did you go by a different name yeah. when you're DJing? What yeah, I went it? by DJ Styles. DJ Styles. And, and I was also Breezy. Okay. Yeah, people were breezy. calling me Breezy. Where'd Breezy come from? Breezy came from because I was real chubby and I was gassy. Yeah. So okay. I was like, farting all the time. Then, that's awesome. I'm gonna just yeah. can I call you DJ Breezy? I thought it was no, awesome. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Next one, uh, track seven, Smile Petty. If I close my eyes to your bullshit, I could still smell it on you. I could smell it from a mile away. Yeah. What are some signs that someone is bullshitting? They don't look you in the eye. Okay, that's a good one. Yeah. <laughs> um, they just start talking in circles, mm. stuttering. Yes. That's a good one. Yeah. So do you call people out right away when they do it, or do you just let them No, I just let them expose let themselves, them. just kind of like, hmm, interesting. interesting. Taking note of everything. Then when I get back, I'm like, tell my assistant, like, off yeah. with their heads. They're, I was going to say, yeah. I'm like, do they get even a second chance after that, or are they just done now, after they both Well, they, they used to. Like, I used to get a lot, third, fourth, fifth, five chances, mm -hmm. but now I'm realizing, like, you kind of have to cut things, in, like, off really quick because it just... The small things build up to like mm -hmm. big problems after a while. Like when you yeah. give too many chances, it's like it comes back to bite you in the butt. Like exactly. it's like, damn, if I would have just, I knew this was BS from the from the rip. Mm -hmm. I should have just cut it off early. Definitely. Uh, next one, trippy. Everybody's looking for love, deep love, a lifetime of deep love. You know, I'm looking for a shower half hour. You know, don't you have luck with women? I, I probably sound horrible when I'm reading your lyrics. <laughs> okay, like, a, lot of a little finesse, the, you know? Well, no, yeah. I can't. I yeah. can't like right. rap or you could say the line, but right. is it? I never had luck with women. What advice do you have for people when it comes to relationships? And what what luck are you talking about? What were some of the bad things? Well, that, that part is from a, a sample from Ronnie Dangerfield. Yeah. He's, like, mm -hmm. really funny comedian. And, like, yeah. I don't know. I just related to that that yeah. um, that quote because, like, back in, even, like, in high school and just back in the days, like, mm -hmm. I was never, like, the ladies' man or anything like that. I was just, like, mm -hmm. looking for, like he said, just some kind of attention, anything. Yeah. And, and then, like, at the end of that quote, he says, you know, the girl told me, come over. There's nobody home. I yeah. went over. There was nobody home. <laughs> and so it's like, I just feel like that was just my luck. Like, I feel like I always have this underdog approach, even when it comes to love. Mm -hmm. And in the song Trippy that that's on, it's like you're trying to grasp a hold of somebody that's like, you know, like a cloud of smoke. So I don't know. My advice would just be just be honest and be yourself. Because that's like when I was being myself and just being me, like that's when I got the most girls. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, next one, Cheers. I see. I feel like. Do you want to read it? I feel Hell like I'm no, butchering. I wrote it. You read it. I know, but I feel like I'm butchering it because I can't rap. I can't it's sing. Okay. You, I don't have. You flow. look great. So that's half the part. But it's just. But see, like if I try, but we'll get to that. Try to later do it in a whisper, first. like a real, like low voice, they like ask that. Ask me where I'm going from here. Now you can't hear me. <laughs> <laughs> they ask me where I'm going from here. Shit, anywhere long as the runway is clear. Shit, music business moving too fast for me. Goddamn. Is that a little better? That wasn't better. They asked me where it? I'm going from here. Shit, anywhere, as long as the runway is clear. <laughs> music business moving too fast for me. Goddamn, wishing I still had Mac with me. How do you tell a nigga slow it down when you're moving just as fast as him? 
I couldn't understand when I seen them stretched out cold on the pavement. Niggas catch TKOs on occasion, wishing I could save them. What was I to say? I was dipping dates, getting in and out of state. We was going in to get away. Sick of feeling so out of place. Wishing I could save them. What was I to say? Yeah. See, so much better. I should have had you do it this whole time. Uh-huh. That was better. So, I like that you said music business moving too fast. So, the music business and the music industry overall, it's just a interesting, weird industry. So what was something that you wish you knew before getting so heavily involved in the music business? Mm, I just wish I knew, like, I wish I, I would just wish I was, like, more patient, you know? Mm-hmm. Just, that's all it is. Like, you have to, like, develop as an artist sometimes. Some people get it really quick, and they lose it really quick. Mm-hmm. Um... I wish I would have known like how much real work it takes and work ethic it really takes and how much patience it takes and not to be like anxious for anything because that's how you start blowing it and making bad decisions, mm. jumping into things that aren't really you, signing contracts that aren't good. Um, fortunately, like I didn't I didn't do any of that, but yeah. it took a while, you know, yeah. and it's still we still got a lot of work to do. But um, that was it. It's just being patient and not anxious to like jump into anything. Definitely. Um, last one for the track, left to right. See, you're gonna have to do this. I chose in the in the intro. It's yeah. Then label me a, label me a criminal, like me some type of animal, and then I don't know. I don't know the rest of it. They won't call me cannibal. <laughs> yeah. Celebrating like it's carnival. Left turn. <laughs> Signal. Bury the food in funeral. Yeah. What about it? What is the biggest? <laughs> Sick lyrics, right? The big, it is. That's why it's... Okay, so what is the biggest misconception that you think people have of you? Biggest misconception? Mm-hmm. Um, hmm. What is the biggest misconception? That's going to be our picture for later, that face. Yeah? I, I like taking fun pictures with people, not <laughs> posing. It's going to be that. <laughs> um, I'm trying to think. Damn. Do you guys know? What's the biggest misconception? Oh yeah, they think oh, wow, there yes, was like four of them. Let's you do all play of them. Every <laughs> instrument, flute, clarinet, sax, jazz, trumpet. Like I play one instrument, which is drums. Okay, that's it, y'all. Y'all gotta Why chill do, with that. There are people like that'll go to that? shows and they'll be like, they see the show and they're like, I saw you get on every instrument and I, I did not. <laughs> I, I got on the drums. I got off the drums and that was it. But I don't know people like. I don't know that this might not be used to that and they think I do everything, but that is a big one. Is yeah. there, well, if you said drums, is there another inter- instrument that you would want to be able to play? Skin flute, um, yeah. uh, <laughs> a, a piano is okay. a big one. Um, and yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty much it. Like, I would love to really like get a grasp on the piano. You know, I like that when you ask the whole room, what are the misconceptions and like four people talk, so we covered his. Yeah. What did you say? <laughs> Who, like, yeah, you did. He doesn't say. Sh- he just sees the shooter. He just he does. What's he swings. the shooter's name? He swings and doesn't doesn't okay, talk. Okay, the shooter did not say yeah, anything. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. He, did he not talks say with his anything. Hands. Yeah. Um, I heard I heard somebody <laughs> say something. Was it you? Is, is this? Right. Yeah. <laughs> Doctor Dre teach you how to play drums. Yeah. Like they just think I'm like yeah. I was always been signed. Yeah. yeah. They think I'm always happy, as they know, you know, sometimes I get, I'm angry is, is sometimes. Any, is anybody, I think anybody who comes off as always happy, like you're a psycho, like, because there's yeah. no way you could be happy. That's me, probably. No, you he's know smiling I mean. when he's pissed. No, I'm smiling all the time, too. Like, yeah. I have a good poker face, but, yeah. like, inside, I'm like, I yeah. want to choke you Full out. Full of rage. Like, yeah. mm-hmm. <laughs> okay, so I liked, okay, I've never done this with anyone, and I was talking to your publicist, Chandra, and I'm like, she's like, oh, is this something that you do? I'm like, no, I actually just, like, randomly want to try it with him just mm. because... So I like that you were you were rapping your lyrics because I couldn't do mm. it, and then I saw you freestyle. So I want to put you into it. you're like no, like, not doing it. What? <laughs> or we don't have to. No, just a quick. So one of my visions before when I was younger. So I've been you know doing interviews for nine years, different artists. I've always just wanted my name in a song respectfully, like just in a thing and dash radio. But like I cannot provide the beat. Yeah. So I don't know. If we what are we supposed to do? Shit. I don't know. It's something with Dash Radio and Jen. What is your so name? Jen Delion. So I was thinking, of, okay, I'm like, what rhymes with Delion? Just so we can get ahead. I was Isn't like, there a tequila in Delion? Yeah. So there, well, there is that tequila, so we can mention that. Right. It's not mine. It's Diddy's. It's not oh, okay. mine. But let's say I was like, Cone, Town. Like, there were so many ones. I'm like, this is easy, or it should be easy. And then you Dash Radio. You have to rap first. So should it just be like a... 
Should we just take turns? I can't I'm rap down this for shit that. though. You heard Me my either. my monotone ass. I think it's sexy. To read it's your cool. lyrics. So, damn, you guys are gonna like have to help. The whole room has to. Who's gonna do? Are you gonna do? You're gonna do the beat. Get it, get I'm nervous. It, go, I'm gonna fuck it, it up. Get it. I'm gonna I'm do your ab lips actually. <laughs> get it. Get it. Wait, who's starting? Yes, love. You. Fuck. Yes, love. Wait, hold on. I wasn't yes, ready for this. All right. Um, yes, love. Go. Anderson Pack is big. Get Shaq. Hey, hey, and that's a fact. I'm on Dash Radio. I got a stack, and I really want Deleon in my lap. Wait, did I say that? Wait, that was a mistake. Is we on the air? Well, that shit's great. Gotta pass it to the left right now. Gotta pass Fuck. It to the I don't know what to say. I'm not a rapper. <laughs> Fuck. I should have put you on the spot. You close it out. No, yeah. <laughs> See, you heard it here first, guys. De Leon spitting those blazing bars on Dash Radio. I'm so Swipe sad. up to hear the single. Man. Man I'm lit. I am so sad. <laughs> hey, at least I got like four words. I liked it. I liked it. All right. Well, before we let you go, let's let everybody know where they can follow you on socials. Get the album. Just and Anderson Pack. Google it. A N D E R S O N dot Pack P A A K. Instagram, Twitter, Friendster, MySpace, Black Planet, uh, DJ Breezy, DJ Breezy <laughs> Styles, <laughs> Gastrix, and Dash Radio, Deleon, Sippin, and the mixtape's coming soon, right? Yes. Oxnard is everywhere. It Shout is. What should my mixtape be called? Um, I'm gonna redo this. I'm gonna really go to the studio the best and that make never my was. <laughs> the best that never was yeah. coming soon. <laughs> All right, thank you for your time. Thank you, appreciate it. <laughs>